Yannick Sinner versus Taylor Fritz is the third quarter final for Indian Wells for 2023. And both players have been impressive to get to this stage. Sinner started the tournament off as the number 11 seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, he'd take on Richard Gasquet, the veteran. And under a close second set, Sinner would get through in straights 6 3, 7 6. In the third round, he'd take on another Frenchman, Manorino. And again, he'd have to battle through a tiebreaker set, but got through in straights 7 6, 6 4. In the fourth round, he'd take on Stan Vavrinka, who would just come off a very epic match against the seven seed. Runa, but they had played in Rotterdam a couple of weeks before, and Sinner just replicated that score, getting through standing straights 6-1, 6-4, to get to the quarterfinals. Fritz started the tournament off as the defending champion and the number four seed, and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he'd take on Shelton, the exciting young American, and after dropping the first set, Fritz would have to fight in three, with his experience prevailing 4-6, 6-4, 6-3. In the third round, he'd take on the number 30 seed Baez, who wasn't really known for his hardcore tennis, mainly a clay quarter, and this showed as Fritz demolished him in straight sets. 6162. In the fourth round, Fritz would take on Fucevic, the unseeded Hungarian who'd beaten Dimonor along the way. But again, this was easy for Fritz, getting through in straights 6463 to advance to his third straight Indian Wells quarterfinal. These two guys have only played the one time before. It was actually at Indian Wells back in 2021 with Fritz getting the win in straight sets, but Sin has changed a lot over those last couple of years. And of course, Fritz has only gotten better too, so I'm expecting a closer match. If Sin is going to win this one, he needs to make Fritz move. Fritz gets frustrated when he has to do a lot of running and he doesn't get to control the baseline. So if Sinner can get on the baseline, start moving Fritz around, get him in a defensive position, maybe come to the net as well, put away some volleys, and Sinner has a very good chance. If Fritz is going to win this one, he needs to use the crowd. They're going to be on his side. He's the defending champion and he is the local hope. He's made three quarterfinals already at this tournament in a row now, and he's going to be the favorite by the crowd. He's also going to make Sinner run because Sinner has a bandage on his knee. So there's something wrong with Sinner physically. Make him run. That's what Fritz is going to have to do. Be aggressive and just make Sinner move. This is going to be a very fun match. Might be the best quarterfinal on the men's draw. I'm going to go three sets for Fritz. I think he's going to sneak it out at the end. It's going to be an absolute banger. And I think the crowd are going to play a big part. I'm going to go with Fritz in three, but let me know down in the comments below who do you think is going to win this one.